Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. thank you for joining me, let's play some more Sims 4. So I just realized that um, I have a maybe a potentially much better layout for this bar. Uh, no, stupid wrong button. If we were to put the bar here, actually, this would be even better. Let's move this thing, put it, put it there for now. A bar kitchen. Badass bar kitchen. And now it needs like bar stools, but we could also um I suppose we could move the trash out of here. Yeah. Put the trash at the end of the bar. Such a dumb little garbage can. It's so so small and ugly. Now we have a bar inside the house. How nuts is that? And we should probably center this here. And our one little tiny nook of a breakfast area is garbage. And it'd be nice if we could just extend this wall and not have an outdoor area at all. I think it'd be better. I mean, yeah, it's good. We got a bar inside the house. Now we can tend bar while everyone's in the house. But we do need more money. Gotta let time pass. Look at this bunch of nerds that want to play over here. Yeah, it's like it's like Facebook. You know, it's like the Facebook room. He's just like he's just like get off the damn computer. I want to use the computer. It's my turn to use the computer. I need to mod games. Get off the computer, Jeff. What are you doing? You're not even you're not even using the computer. None of you are. You're just choosing this chair. Oh, okay. Um, you're gonna go here. You're gonna go here. Get off these chairs. Flash crazy eyes. Do it. And you are going to mod some games. Why don't you mod Blick Block? We need more comfortable chairs. Damn, look at that! Jeff! Jump on her! Jeff, get her! Stop talking with these guys. Go get her! Quick! Out of your pajamas! Oh, look, they both just changed outfits. He's feeling flirty. Alright. Go and do a uh, flirty introduction. How you doing? How you? Oh, I see you're walking by my house. Do you like my second floor wall? It's pretty nice, isn't it? Uh huh. You know, you look oddly familiar. Ish. A little fatter, maybe. Sexy pose. Go straight for it, man. Just see how she reacts. Maybe she'll like it. Oh, she does. Damn, she's easy. Give her a rose, and then kiss her hands, and then kiss her. Hey, kiss hands, kiss hands. No, don't do that twice. Don't do anything twice. We've learned our lesson. Um, Below a kiss, and then do a first kiss. No, not kiss hands, you dumbass. First kiss. Try it. Damn, she is one easy woman. Damn, she's easy. She's just digging everything Jeff has to say. Titillating banter. Whoa, Jeff Worthington and Savannah are both having their first kiss. Oh my gosh. Jeff, you, you dog. Nice. He wants to tell a dirty joke. Okay, do that. More choices. Wait, it's probably under funny, isn't it? Tell a dirty joke. She'll dig it. She's into all kinds of kinky stuff. She doesn't get it. Alright, just, just go straight for the nonsense crap. Just... I mean, do we want a girlfriend? 
Do it. Just try it. You just met her. And this is crazy. Alright. You're hungry. Well, you made all the food. You haven't cooked in a while. Cook something. Cook an apple pie. We have $80 to our name. Savannah just became the girlfriend of Jeff. Well, that was easy. There you go, Jeff. Go woohoo. Go brag to her. Go brag to what's her face. Give her some advice. <laughs> you see, what you need to do is you find someone on the side of the road, you track them down, you just jump on them. Don't let them off the hook. Very flirty. And she is happy. Well, let's see if you can get yourself into some problems already. Gush about partner. Oh, she'll love that. Dance with her. Brighten her day. Tell her how amazing you are and how she'll never get any of this. Flirt with her. And then ask her a risque question. Just keep messing with her. Tease her along. She'll regret it soon enough. <laughs> nice job, Dawson. You can now make viruses. He also can hack school grades. Nice. I guess you should take a shower. If you have to. Talking with friends. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> Let's be realistic here. Um, you don't have time for a shower, evidently. That's too bad. He's gonna be really. He's gonna have a bad day at work. He's about done modding Blickbach. Did he do it? Are you gonna have a good day at work? He needs to mod another game first. Hmm. Eight hours. Six hours. Two days. You need more friends, Jeff. You're really bad at this game. And you should be making more food. So just cook some more stuff. You know, cook the cheapest stuff you can. Make some scrambled eggs. And then cook after that some uh, a garden salad. We're cheap. We're poor now. Make ramen noodles. Fifteen bucks. Royalty report. Three, six, and six. See, she's she's getting better at it. Jeff is a creepy dude. It was only worth three dollars. You need to write more books. You have two days. Why don't you eat something that Jeff or uh, Raj just made? Uh, yeah, of course, more pasta, because we're pastafarians. And then use the fancy pants one to write some books, more short stories. Go. That money will add up. I'm telling you. Flash paper fiction. Sounds great. Like 12 bucks a day. Are you writing your book? You need another computer. Are you cooked enough? Only 50% done. Damn. Cook scrambled eggs for eight. Stop talking to her. What is this? Come on over. It's fine. She'll be home all day. Level 4 writer. Apparently she's just going to let herself in. That's fine. She is tense from stale surroundings. Apparently buying a whole new room is not good enough. She needs different stuff. Fine, I'll tell you what. We, no, we have no money. Write a good book. And then I'll get you some fancy materialistic crap. <laughs> She's just coming over to use the computer. Hey, nice Raj. What's that all about? Crap. Apparently cooking all of that food is really hard for you. Go sleep for a bit. We'll just have him sleep right up till it's time to go to work. Give him ten minutes to go potty. And then you're off. Get out of here. You look okay. What are you doing? 
Oh, he's washing his hands. That's good. He's a cook. He should do that. What an achievement. Natalie's finished writing an entire book. Good job, Natalie. You're getting really good at this. And you are hungry, and you're feeling trapped. Well, boy, do we have something in store for you. It's pie. I don't remember telling him to make a pie. Should definitely put that toilet someplace that's easier to click. 19 hours. Everyone's sleeping in the middle of the day. You gotta go to work in 39 minutes. And you still don't have enough friends. No one likes you, Jeff. Except for your girlfriend. But she's easy. <laughs> she doesn't count. What are you doing, Natalie? What the hell? Why are you taking a nap outside on the, just in a wedding dress of all places? That's a bad idea. If you're tired, take, go to actual sleep. Dawson's already home $500. Sweet. We need bar stools. Chairs. Living chairs? Dining chairs? What if we search for bar? Bar... Stools. Bar in bar stools. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. So we got a Eschen metal bar stool. We've got a spin industrial bar stool. The celestial. It's more comfortable. They're all really uncomfortable though. The cephalopod bar stool with back support. Damn. Seven hundred fifty bucks. A domestic satellite. It looks very modern. We'll buy one of those. Excellent. And we're out of money. Somebody go make money. Jeff, bring home some funds. Why didn't you get promoted? What's wrong with you? All right, you need a shower. Take a bubble bath and then go to sleep. We need better beds. Oh, Natalie. <laughs> Stop it with the napping. I told you to take it, go to actual sleep. You don't have to work today. If you're tired, go to actual sleep. I'm okay with you sleeping at 5 in the afternoon. I don't care about schedules. I said go to sleep, woman. Get in bed. She's got a book in her inventory. She needs to publish that. The Heckler. Jeff has just won over the crowd at a local event. When some attention hog gets jealous and starts heckling him, he can play it two ways. Take Mr. Funny Guy head on or repay his insults with silence. Challenge him. Nice. Jeff gets him good. Who's laughing now, clown face? Nice job, Jeff. You're still a loser. Nobody likes you. You'll never have any friends. Alright, how you guys doing? You ready to wake up and do some more slave work? I mean, programming and writing? All right, 216 bucks. And promoted to mixologist. Raj has been promoted for an extra $9 per hour. Finally, we're seeing some promotions for Raj. His next shift is Sunday at 6 p.m. It is uh, currently Saturday. So he works tomorrow at 6 in the morning. That is uh, really soon. But he got $515 bonus and an Umber kitchen sink. The Umber Kitchen Sink, Hygiene 5, Reliability 3, Inspiring inspiring Decor 2. So compare that to this sink, which is 3-3. This one is 5-3 with Inspiring Decor. So that one's out. Uh, we don't even need it anymore. 16 bucks out the drain. Wow, it's like brown. That does not match our our stuff. Can we change the color? I think there is a way. Design tool. Oh yeah, that looks way better. Cool. I'm learning how to play this game. I know how to play this game. I'm not listening to you. We need more of these things. We're out of money. Oh shoot, we need beds. We need better beds. Are you taking a nap? Seriously, Raj? Go to sleep, sleep. I'm telling you, man. 
Oh, he goes to work at 6 p.m., not a.m. Okay, first off, turn that off and go to sleep. Real sleep. I think that thing woke him up. You should go to the bathroom before you go to bed. And actually, why don't you take a shower? I know it's 12 at night. It's perfectly reasonable. That thing's looking pretty grungy. He changed out of his pajamas to get into his outfit to get into his pajamas. That's kind of funny, actually. Well, they decided to wake up at the same time. Who gets first use? I'm going for him, probably. And you can go eat. Got spoiled food everywhere. Makes sense. That's normal for this household. More hamburger cake. We like it. We need another toilet. We need better beds. We need all kinds of cool stuff. Somebody needs to come clean this mess up, too. Alright, you are hungry now, too. You can have some hamburger cake as well. Someone turn the music on and woke them up. Damn it. See, I need to move these stupid beds. Can we fit more beds in there? Freaking bunk beds, man. No, we don't want to remove the floor. Are you nuts? Totally. Bunch of pod people. That's what they are. They're gonna live and dine and eat and sleep and do everything together. That does mean that we won't have very many tables out there for anyone anymore. Oh well, you know, they can't be being woken up by this stupid thing. It's just not okay. Are you cleaning? She's actually cleaning! The woman is cleaning! Damn, I'm impressed. Alright, I'm gonna command you little bastards to clean up. Well, that's still... No! Don't! Stop! It's spoiled! Everyone clean the house. Get this stuff organized. Look at them go. I think they're still gonna choose these chairs because they're better. Aren't they? Are they better? They're comfort 3. Comfort 7. No, you should use the bar stools, man. Alright, I'm going to take a break here. I do look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.